Hey guys, hope you enjoyed this little video today uh, showing off the performance of the D750 and what it can do. As you can see, it handles noise very well. So I just wanted to show you this, this setting in the, in the D750 called High ISO Noise Reduction. So I shot this entire video with this setting off. I did turn it on for this little test right here. So you can see the flower before with no noise reduction and with noise reduction. It looks practically the same. There's no difference. Uh, whatsoever. As you can see the D750's flat picture profile is so good. You can see in those in the in the beginning of the video you can see the difference between not having a picture profile and having the flat picture profile. It just looks so good. You can bring back so much detail with that flat picture profile. And I just want to show you, you can see and in this little clips right here as you can see uh, this is the D3300 recording and it was using uh, ISO 3200 I think in this shot right here using ISO D3200 I mean 3200 and now I'll show you what the Nikon D750 can do this is the 800 800 ISO looks very clean very nice and clean and this is how 3200 looks like it's very 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 clean too not bad. So we're gonna see them side by side now. The D750 with 100 ISO and the D3300 with the same 100 ISO, and they look pretty clean. Now we're gonna see another test where uh, up close you can see it looks kind of noisy. It is really noisy, and with noise reduction, it looks quite good on both cameras. So in conclusion, I think the D750 just gets you that better high ISO performance, as you can see from the clips. The D1300 just struggles too much. So I hope you enjoyed this video guys and until next time guys, bye.